Well, the weather tonight could also have an impact on all of those Black Friday shoppers who will be out bright and early to score some big bargains. Eyewitness News reporter Todd Vicaprikian is live in Seekonk tonight where people have already started to line up. Yeah, they have already started to line up. Good evening. Well, laws in Massachusetts and Rhode Island, known as blue laws, prevent stores from opening until after midnight. This Best Buy behind me will open at 1 a.m., so we're a little less than two hours away from that. Take a look at the line here behind me. It's been growing within the last hour, and people camping out here in the cold tell me this is a part of their Thanksgiving tradition. <laughs> we're here, baby. Waiting in line in snowy Seekonk. So far, we've been out here for 16 hours. We're planning on to go for 22 hours. This may not be the average person's idea of fun on Thanksgiving, but for these guys, camping out in a tent is tradition. We just come out here more for the fun. In a, in a city, keep camping. That's what we call it. It's waiting for deals on electronics for most. We're waiting for uh, the 50-inch TV. It's $200. Kitchen appliances for some. And I also got a sandwich breaker one year. Or not having anything specific to buy for others. See the deals, and we don't have any plan of action. We just go in and hopefully walk out with something great. People we talk to say the camaraderie is what gets them through the hours waiting in the cold. We talk to people that are here. We meet people. It's a once-a-year a thing, and why not? It's just like taking part of a festivity. Okay. It's, it's almost what it's like. This is kind of our family, I guess. We call it back Black Friday family. It's just have fun, something different. Police have been keeping an eye on the crowd, but it's been a peaceful wait for the doors to open. I also talked with Best Buy headquarters. They tell me those blue laws even prevent employees from coming on site until after midnight, so they'll get here then to prep for that 1 a.m. opening. Live in Seekonk with the Mobile Newsroom, Tadavik Aprikian, Eyewitness News.